In our last episode, we gave you a glimpse of what happens after your recycling is picked up. Well, to bring you up to speed, it ends up here at Ruta Recycling and becomes a part of a complex system with a number of stages, including trucks weighing in, a tipping floor, a huge team of hand sorters, and more conveyor belts than you can ever imagine. There's even an electromagnetic one that has a thing for steel and tin. And considering that more items recycled means less landfill content, it's a system that has one goal in mind, volume. We have about 400 trucks that arrive here each day and we process 800 tons of recyclable materials. Nationwide, waste management recycles enough newspaper to save 41 million trees a year. We recycle enough aluminum and plastic to save hundreds of thousands of barrels of oil each year. So um, recycling is extremely kind to the environment and uh, it's certainly when we go to single stream recycling like we do here at the Ruder facility, we see an increase in overall recycling by about 30%. The kind of volume generated here is made possible in part because of the participation of Miami-Dade County and its residents. Miami-Dade was the first county in South Florida to make the move to single stream, so they showed a lot of initiative and forethought. And again, more and more people are thinking green at home and are understanding the importance of recycling. And um, we just really feel very good and want to uh, applaud Miami-Dade for the initiative the county took in moving in this direction. You can help make the county's single stream recycling efforts even more successful by following the recycling guidelines of the Department of Solid Waste Management. Simply log on to miamidade.gov slash DSWM and click on curbside recycling. While there, be sure to sign up for recycling alerts to receive an email reminder the night before your scheduled pickup day. Until next time, be well and be green.